वेलकम टू फर्स्ट वेबिनार ऑफ ओराल स्टेक एंड निकेता एस सीएफओ ऑफ ओराल स्टेक फर्स्ट लेट्स इंट्रोड्यूस आवरसेल्फ टेल योर नेम स्कूल एंड प्लेस कैन यू इंट्रोड्यूस योरसेल्फ माय नेम इज अल्ट्रा एंड आई एम इन फर्स्ट ग्रेड ओके व्हिच स्कूल वेरी वेल एलिमेंट्री बाल भारती पब्लिक स्कूल हेलो 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 गुड इवनिंग My name is Aryan Reddy, and I am in sixth standard. I mean seventh standard. I, I was promoted, and I study in Rain International School, Nirul. And another thing, Aryan, I cannot see your uh, video. I cannot see you. Yeah, I will turn it on now. Yeah. Hi, my name is Rohan. Um, I am in seventh grade, and I live in Singapore. Okay, and uh, we can still we cannot see you. Yeah, we're having a dinner. Oh. We'll come back soon. Guru, can you uh, hear me? And you have to unmute yourself. I cannot see you. I mean, see you and hear you. I cannot see you nor hear you. Yeah. Drew. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Just click on again. Just click on it. Okay. Hello, my name is Hagen. I'm from. I'm seventh grade. Okay. My name is Rohan. Where are you from? Where are you from? I am from Coimbatore. Okay. Now, Sangha will be taking the class. Okay. Thank you. And so today we are going to uh, make an LED blink. And let me play the video just a second. One is the smaller one. Can you see that? Yes. And one is the smaller one, and the other one is bigger than the other. Uh, so the bigger one goes to. positive or the digital pin and the smaller one goes to ground or negative and uh, this is the board this is an arduino uno uh, we uh, have thank you well thank you very much this is the uh, analog pin these are the analog I'm pins there. these are the analog pins this vin is the power that is coming uh, from here that is the power input and the programming port and uh, yes vin can you see that now nah it's uh vin uh then there is ground two grounds actually that is the negative and 5 volt that is the power you get 5 volts there then 3.3 volt which is you get less power than 5 volts and then r es res uh, yeah res i don't know what that is and again another 5 volt and a pin next to that which is not named then uh, from here most of these are digital pins oh, my camera is not good that's why i was going to show you the video yes and uh, you can see zero and one here uh, zero is rx and rx means receiver so if you are like if you are having a bluetooth device just uh, put the 
transmitter on the rx that is a tx on rx and rx on tx tx is the transmitter on this which is one and from 2 to 13 are the digital pins uh, and can you see the small line next some digital uh, pins uh, that is those are pwm pins that is used to uh, control the brightness or brightness of an led or um, to control the speed of a motor can you see these lines on some uh, pins and then there's another ground and there is a um, an ARF which I don't know what it does and an SCL and SDA which are communication pins used for uh, OLEDs and all that I2C modules and all that we'll talk about it this is a GSM which is used for S for uh, SMS and all that. Oh my God, this drum band. I we are not going to talk about this today. It's just that I already soldered it to the board. I didn't want to remove it, so that's why I just <laughs> have this still attached to the board. Um, you can get this Arduino Uno board for uh, kind of 600 or less LED for 2 rupees each and then most importantly we have this. This is the USB used to uh, connect the Arduino Uno to the laptop. As you can see this, uh, this is an 8B uh, type USB cable and this part, this part goes to here like this and this part goes to the computer port. So I'm just going to power this up. Small one is uh, in ground and the larger one is uh, in D13, actually it's just written in this, that means digital printer. And yes, just going to connect this to the port. This is blinking now. This is what we are going to do today. Hi everybody, my name is Uday Shankar, our CTO of Eurus Tech. So, um, today we are going to learn about uh, an LED and how to make it blink after each second. So the components we need are this LED which is a 3mm LED uh, which can come in any color which you can get for 2 rupees and this Arduino Uno which you can get for 600 or less rupees and the cable for that which you can get for 50 or less rupees. is an A to B USB cable for the Arduino Uno R3 and you put this part here to this port and as you can see this LED has two pins one is shorter and the other one is longer and uh, the shorter one goes to the negative part of the board which is ground and the longer one goes to the positive part which can be either 5 volt or 3.3 volt or um, the digital pin usually it's a digital pin so I'm just go I have already uploaded the program into this UNO so uh, I'm just going to connect the short one to the ground here and the longer one to the D13 here 
Okay, so the GND part is the ground or otherwise the negative pin and 13, the pin 13 is the digital pin. Actually, you can have it in, in any pin. Uh, just You just need to change the program a bit, just a bit. Uh, I'll show you that later. And so I'm just going to power the other part. Use this power bank for actually any power bank to power this board. Or you can just solder a, a battery which can be from, I think this board can be from 3.3 to up to 12 volts battery uh, and connect it to a switch and then uh, connect that switch to the board. For now we are just going to connect this part of the USB to the port in the uh, bank and the program is running. So we are going to program this board in mblock which is one of the easiest programming platforms so if you don't have mblock you just go to a web browser and just type download mblock for windows 10 this is the windows i have or you can use uh, you can just type whichever windows you have and just I'm gonna take this and yeah M block 5 for windows you also have uh, M block for Mac iOS Android Linux and Chromebook so I'm just going to uh, download this M block 5 for Windows and uh, just check it has Arduino Uno in it so that uh, you can program with the Arduino Uno and oh we also have Arduino Mega here which is a bigger version of the Arduino Uno and when I mean big it's really big. So I'm just going to download this. So after downloading it, uh, just open it and it will ask things like, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? For that, give yes. Then it will ask, select setup language. You can see English already in the option, so no need to change that and press ok next it will ask select destination location just click next because there is already a name on the options bar then it will ask start menu folder i mean select start menu folder just click next because as you know there is already a name on the bar then click install that will take some time finally it will ask completing the mblock setup wizard just click finish then you will see a new app called mblock on the main screen open it so we have the mblock home screen here so uh, we are just going to take devices home screen in mblock you can see that it has sprite Sprites background and devices. So we just need devices and you can see Kodi here which we do not need. So let's just cancel that. Delete. 
and you might have learned scratch which is just like uh, this and this can also be used like scratch as you can see when we click sprite we have uh, all the blocks and all that from scratch and we have add sprite we already have this panda sprite and the background which you can uh, make a background or make costumes and sounds and new background i don't think uh, i don't know if this has i've not checked you can make a costume for the background so for now we are just going to control the led so we are going to take devices and add now you can see this has many uh, things and this is the arduino maker the bigger version of arduino Uno. and this also has many other devices which are made by M Block. M Block is a company which makes um, uh, robots and things like that. It has many things here. We also have the Arduino Nano. That's good. Arduino Micro, Arduino Leonardo, Arduino Yun. We have many Arduino boards and we have the mega pipe pro which is another board for uh, things that m block makes so for now we just need oops and again uh, we just need the arduino uno so we are just going to press this plus and it's going to download it will only download uh, for the first time after that you can just uh work click on it and then press ok and it will come here so i'm just going to connect this usb uh, cable to the port in the on the laptop there now you can hear that sound that means it's connected so we are just going to take this connect and it will show no devices can be detected to connect so we just need to click show all connectable devices Oops. and we can see com5 which is a port which on which the usb is connected so we are just going to click connect Connection error. I'm just going to uh, remove this and disconnect this again. And that side is also connected. Hmm? Just going to click connect. Yes, it is connected. So we are uh, going to drag when Arduino Uno starts up. That means when the board is on. Uh, we are going to attach some lines of program here. So we are going to make uh, an LED blink. So we are going to pin and uh, set digital pin 9 output SI. We are going to take that and change this 9 to 13 as my LED is now in. You can put your LED wherever, whichever pin you want. Uh, but it has to be digital so I'm just going to take this uh, 13 output as high that means it is on and I am going to take the same thing change it to 13 and it should be low and I'm just going to uh, a control and wait one second put that here and here you might be familiar with all of these uh, from scratch except maybe these two but I don't know and I am just going to do forever loop I'm just going to put the forever loop here and upload it 
might take some time. Not that much actually. It has started uploading. And there my LED is blinking. So uh, I also want to show you another thing that if you want you can also write in Arduino C. As you know C is a computer language but we don't need to do that now. We'll uh, learn about Arduino um, later. And you can just click block. And you can see this here and just click on that and you can see the Arduino program here. But uh, we don't need all of this when we are going to do it in Arduino. Just some of this. this. Uh, for example, we just need this. It will have void setup and then uh, we only need to put remote 13 output in that. And uh, this digital write 13 comma one uh, and delay one and actually it should be delay 1000 will be in void loop which will be there already and this line will not be there in anything unless it's a loop so as I said we have the Arduino program here. We're just going to uh, not use that for now. Mm. And I also forgot to tell you one thing. I told you that high is uh, that means that the LED is on. But I didn't tell you what low is. Low is that that means the LED is off. So, if you want to save this program in mBlock, uh, we just need to click on save. And just try, uh, you might need your uh, parent to help you with the email, typing the email uh, and all that. Or you can also continue with Google. But whatever you do, you need a parent with you. Do this. Uh, email stuff and all. So, if you want to take an already saved um, program, you just take file and open and you will see all the programs. But I have not signed in so I cannot take that. Uh, so, you can first you have to, before saving you have to uh, put a name for the program. So, I am just going to put LED uh, blink. Yeah, but uh, I, I cannot save it so I'm just, I just wrote it. So that is how you make an LED blink uh, in M block. And if you want you can also make a game or something in on, on the sprites space. And you can also change black background if you want. Just like Scratch. Uh, if you don't know what Scratch is. Scratch is like an app. But you can also take it online on a web browser. Uh, it's just. It was made by MIT. Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Uh, you can make games. And uh, greeting cards. Uh, animations and stuff like that and that you can also play games made by other people and you can also see animations blah 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 so we don't need that but I just told you so this is more like uh, very similar to scratch block but the difference is that you can program uh, devices in this which is something you cannot do on scratch 
so after we learn about uh, some more led applications we will uh, go to arduino but i'm not going to take that now uh, actually you can either have the arduino ide which is the app or if you want you can also do it in m block in this arduino c section so but you cannot write here because this is uh, a read only place see not edit in read only editor so that's it for today and bye Uh, so enjoy your day and uh, good night for people uh, in the time zone where it is night and good morning for people in the time zone where it is the where it is morning and bye